Tech Legion. Uh, we're going to have a little amendment today to the Noctua fan review. They were kind enough to send us uh, a few extra fans so we could throw it on our water cooling loop to see how they performed. Uh, as you can see they are installed right here and they are fairly quiet. Uh, you can't hear them. The little hum you hear is the uh, two water pumps that I have running in the loop right now. Uh, <clears throat> anyways what we're going to do is I'm going to flip the camera around here. I'm going to show you the my second monitor I have set up here. And I'm going to try and get in as close as I can so you can kind of see what's going on. And what we have here is the uh, Asus uh, Fan Expert software. Right now the one fan is connected up to the CPU uh, header on the motherboard and it's right here. And it is uh, running at uh, less than 50%, just over 40. And it is uh, idling at uh, 20C right now, or 23C to be exact. So what we're going to do is we're going to run uh, five runs of Lynx, which is up here. And it's set for uh, maximum stress on uh, 8 gigs of RAM, 30,000 problems. And uh, we have core temp down here. As you can see, the minimum temp so far at idle is 23C with a max of 27. And it's uh, set uh, for 4 gigahertz. Uh, right now it's running at a, a 11, uh, yeah, so 1100 megahertz. And it's fluctuating in between uh, that and the 4 gigahertz mark where it's set to. So once we start stress testing, this will jump to 4 gigahertz and we're going to watch the uh, PMW function of the fan kick in and out and it's going to raise up and down respectively as we go. So I'm going to start the test here and uh, if it gets really noisy that'll be the uh, video card we have in there. It's a 6970 and as you know they sound like jet engines when they start up. So here we go. Right now, Lynx is working uh, individual cores, running them to 100%. The, uh, it has jumped up to 4 gigahertz, and it's just cycling through. Okay, now each core is now at 100%, all six cores. So the max temp so far is 38 degrees Celsius and the PMW of the fan is starting to raise up, still below 50% idle speed on the fan. All cores are still at 100%. Let's see if I can get in here. So 
I don't know if it's very clear or not. There we are. A little bit better. Anyways, all cores are 100% at uh, 4016 megahertz. We've reached a max temp of 41C so far. That's going to get close to finishing the first uh, the first test. After this first test, we'll pause it and I'll let it run through, and then I'll uh, start taping again when the uh, fifth round is about to finish. Okay, so the PMW on the fan just jumped up to 60%. And there we are, we just finished our first swap. As you can see, the first one is completed here. So I'm going to pause it now and I'll bring, uh, I'll bring you guys back in when we get done uh, being close to being done running the fifth. Okay, as you can see here guys, uh, we have finished the five runs, we finished without any errors. And it was a total of 23 minutes and 36 seconds. And you can see here our max temperature reached was 42 degrees Celsius at 100% load. And in the AI suite, you can still see the uh, fans running a little high. That's because it just finished now, but that will drop uh, via the PMW control once the uh, system starts to cool down. Uh, the fans, from a user standpoint, completely inaudible over uh, any of the other fans in the system or the hum of the pumps. So they perform really well, they keep your system cool, or at least this test system here, and uh, yeah, some great fans from Noctua.